How you guys doing? Steve here again. Uh, gonna give you a quick rundown on uh, Ohm's Law and how it relates to vaping. If you didn't get that by the whole intro. Now, a couple people have asked me what do these resistances mean in reference to cardamizers, atomizers, which one should I get? Uh, well, low resistance means lower resistance It's to simulate high voltage vaping. And in this video I'm going to break down what the common voltages are, voltages are, and pretty much what they are supposed to emulate. Okay, and I'm going to take you over to my wipey board thingy and uh, break down exactly what the resistances are and how to figure it out yourself. So, here we are. Okay, here we are at our, my nice, shiny, you know, white people board. And I'm going to show you how Ohm's Law works, pretty much. Now, the easiest way I can describe Ohm's Law is by this triangle that you now see before you. Okay, inside this triangle, there are three sections. Now, top section, if I can write it, is volts. On bottom right, we have our resistance. Okay, you get the you get the gist. And here, this I is the current or the work being done. Okay. From this, we can, you know, figure out Ohm's law. Okay? Simply by this formula, we can take the, you know, you could divide the volts from the current, or vice versa, whichever, and you can figure out what the resistance is. You can divide the volts from the resistance, which is going to be our primary equation, to figure out the current, or the work being done. Or if you so happen to know the current, you could simply times the current and the resistance and you'll get your finished voltage. From this equation we you know will be done yeah this is the basis for everything you're about to see. Okay now the standard resistance that most atomizers are is 3.2 ohms. That is our standard, our baseline. Now, at this resistance, I had to get my notes. Okay, from this resistance, we have our three most common voltages. 3.7, 5, and six. Okay, this is our standard atomizer. Now, from our standard atomizer, at these voltages, and now I'm going to tell you their num numeric value of the amount of current. At the, that voltage, our finished current, I don't know if you were following along with your calculator or if you're that smart and you can do math in your head, we have one, ah, I can't freaking write, hang on, 
two is the amount of work being done or current. And at five volts, it is 1.6 rounded up. And at six volts, it is 1.9, again, rounded up. So when you're figuring it out low resistance, these are the usual targets. Now, uh, the lower resistances tend to be 2.8, 2.4 and 2 or sometimes 2.2 now if you remember our um, if you wrote down or I, shit, I should have probably put it oh well okay at this current or at this resistance sorry we have a current of 1.3 which was a little higher than our standard at 3.7 was 1.2. Okay, so at 3.7, you'll see more work being done. More work being done, more vapor, sometimes a more intense flavor. Now, at 2.4, the work being done was, or is, 1.5, which is almost 5 volts. You know, it's, it is our roughly close to 5 volts simulated, or um, I guess it would be simulated 3.7 or, you know, 5 volts at standard resistance. And at 2 ohms, resistance atomizer equals 1.9, which is equal to close to 6 volts. There you have it. The long and the short of it. Right out in front of you. So what you do is you take your voltage, divide the resistance, we'll say that is, we're, I get, yeah, whatever, we'll, equals current. So there you go. Voltage divided by resistance equals current. And there you go. I don't even know if that was in camera. So yeah. That is the long and the short of it. You can do 5 volt vaping, 6 volt vaping, simulated at 3.7 using these two these resistances. Or if you uh, are as adventurous enough, you can take 2.8 at 6 volts, and I guess it might simulate 7 volts if you really wanted to. But pff, some people like that kind of thing. So there it is. Happy vaping. On, let, me, let me do this right. Happy vaping. I'll see you on the forums. Three points. Oh, fuck. Do it with a lower cost 